John, welcome to Art Expo New York 2018 and specifically Photo Solo 2018. Over 50 photographic artists that are here from around the world. I know that you were right in the running as far as winning one of the awards for Photo Solo. And throughout the course of the, the show, you have had models that have come in. You've been painting the models and they've become a live piece of artwork. But specifically, after that is done, you do something unique and different with those characters. Yes, well, yes, thank you. One of the things we do is not only dress them in art, but then we also have to photograph, so that way people can have the opportunity to see what you've seen in the back. Uh, it's a process that takes from seven to eight hours, so yes, we were getting up at six o'clock in the morning to make sure people understand that this is no Photoshop. This is actually on the model. It takes time, and then from there, goes for the progress and process of photographing them in backgrounds or photographing them on location. You know, I'm looking at this particular piece has intrigued me so much because of the way you've staged the piece. Now, I'm curious, when you, when you created this piece, because we see this background, this, this uh, imposed background that you have, and then the model being brought forward, the luggage and so forth, all staged in sort of a 40s era, war era kind of setting. Uh, wh where did that shoot take place? Okay, well this was done in a studio. What we did is we created a few different props and then the only real thing here that you see is the hat and the shoes. Everything else is painted. And that's one of the parts that we try to create that illusion so people not only feel like they're back on the 40s or they're back in the pin-up style, pin days, and that's part of my job as an artist. It's great work. We, uh, we were thrilled all show long to see how you were doing it, how it was being translated. Congratulations on a great show.